do you build the impossible? A city for humanity. A city for which there are no blueprints. A city to welcome the world. You dream. But like all good stories, we should go back to the beginning. It starts with a vision. The promise to make history. Become the first Middle Eastern city to host a World Expo. In 2013, that promise became a commitment. A commitment to unite the world with the best of humanity. But as that commitment was becoming a reality, our world as we knew it changed forever. Health authorities have identified a new deadly virus. COVID-19 has been declared a global pandemic. All international travel has been suspended. Quite simply, stay at home. global in-person event of its kind. Dubai may be ready for the world, but will the world show up? I could never have dreamed this. Imagine the biggest playground in the world. It's even bigger than that. Imagine traveling in a time machine and seeing the future. With robots walking the streets. Welcome to Expo 2020 Dubai. Imagine sustainable cities for my grandchildren. We could harvest water for us all. You don't have to imagine. It's all here. Everybody is here. 192 countries? That's a lot. I'm going to be straight with you. I'm here for the food. And it's not just the pavilions. I met so many amazing people here. It's Kenya's story. It's Brazil's story. It's New Zealand's story. This is the world story. Bringing the world together has been an incredible journey. A journey that reflects the character and resolve of this unique and extraordinary city. This is the realization of a dream, 50 years in the making a moment to bring the world together. Guided by the values of our nation, resilience, adaptability, and the sheer determination to succeed. A commitment to the vision of our founders, making the impossible possible at the crossroads of the world. It's incredible to be part of the largest show on earth. There's so many different nationalities to work with, so many people from different walks of life. Finland, Japan, people from all over the world. The Columbia Pavilion, a white building surrounded by green that shows a structure that is growing as Colombia is growing. At Hungary Pavilion, we present water. That's what connects us all, regardless of our religion, of our race. Here at the Egyptian Pavilion, we tell people, hey, look, we have more than the pyramids. We also have a lot of great plans coming ahead of us. The Swedish Pavilion is a showcase of sustainability in all its forms, economic, environmental, and social. The opportunity to showcase what Kenya has, it's been a wonderful experience. We've made a lot of connections. Cross religion, cross history, cross geography. This is what Expo is all about. Is something that will linger in our mind for years and for generations to come. At a time when the world needed it most, we found a true moment of global solidarity. 
with an uncertain future and a host of new challenges. The greatest hope we have is each other. I knew one day you'd have to go. As we say our last goodbyes and head back to the places near and far that we call home, we can reflect on the countless experiences we've shared here. You're on, but don't forget your way back home. It's amazing to put all cultures together. It's fantastic. Over 20 million of us from more countries than ever before leave here united by a shared dream and bonded by a common purpose. Wherever you go, Every one of us changed by the realization that I can too. No we will build the future that we want for humanity. Expo City will live on as a permanent fixture of Dubai and as an enduring beacon of the city's commitment to creating a future of opportunity, mobility, and sustainability. Until we meet again. Until we meet again. See you next time. Hasta luego. Dopo bacinha. Comencia a tiempo. Wherever you go, may your heart stay here. No matter how far may your light shine. Until we meet again.